can you mentally find out and the emphasis is on the word mentally what is 102 times 103 in 3 seconds so your time starts now the time is up the correct answer would be 10506 yeah there it is 10506 now to multiply 102 with 103 all you need to do is add this 3 to this entire number so 102 plus 3 is 105 now two more digits to go so 2 3 times is 6 so put 06 here I'm sure this time you have figured out what I have done isn't it again I have used the same base method of multiplication I have used the base as 100 right so 103 is 3 more than the 100 so add this extra 3 to this entire number so we'll get the first three digits of your answer all right now since 100 has two zeros so there are two more places to go so for that just simply multiply this number with this number two three times is six okay so since there is one empty space here what do we do put some extra cheese in it <laughs> all right yeah so just put zero there that's it and I am explaining it to you so I have to put down everything but you need not do all that thing isn't it you are just seeing these numbers can't you say that the answer would be one zero five zero six isn't it just in your mind add this three to 102 which is not a very difficult thing to do so you will get the first three digits one zero five now for the last two digits all you need to do is multiply this two with three so put zero six there as simple as that okay so now you find out and mentally what is 105 times 102 have you said the answer right whatever you said is absolutely correct the answer is 10710 isn't it add this 2 to 105 so it is 107 two more days to go because base 100 has two zeros so just multiply this number with this number 5 2 times is 10 so 10710 come on you're multiplying a three digit number with another three digit number mentally in two or three seconds what more do you want perhaps multiply a four digit number with another four digit number in one one second <laughs> yeah and that is what we are about to do okay so keep your fingers crossed what is 133 times 103 again the same thing add this 3 to 133 so 136 now two more digits to go all right now 33 three times so multiply it with 3 from left to right so 3 3 times is 9 and 3 3 times is 9 so the answer is 136 9 9 now try to multiply 162 with 134 now as you can see that 134 is at the distance of 34 from 100 so add this 34 to 162 all right so it would be 166 176 186 196 okay using the jumping 10 trick of addition all right now two more digits to go here right so for that you have to multiply 62 with 34 how do you do that using the one step arrow multiplication so 6 3 times is 18 and 6 4 times is 24 and 3 2 times is 6 and 24 plus 6 is 30 and 2 4 times is 8 so 18 plus 3 is 21 0 8 so you write 21 here and 0 8 here so the answer would be 19 plus 2 is 21 and 7 0 8 that is what your answer is you see how beautifully these easy cal tricks integrate with each other isn't it that is the beauty of it all one trick seamlessly merging with the other trick okay now let's see if you can multiply 1006 with 1003 now you are trying to multiply two four date numbers all right and you'll see that it is as easy as multiplying a single date number all right so again same thing add this 3 to this entire number so it would be 1009 now what you must have observed is that that the base here is 1000 isn't it 1000 has three zeros so three more places to go all right so six three times is 18 so we write zero one eight that's our answer see 
it's huge <laughs> right